If you haven't had any water today, you're not doing yourself any favors. Uh, have a sip. What is up, you guys? Hello, YouTube. Welcome to my second channel. Uh, I'm Taylor Liz, and this is my fitness channel, or IRL. I know I look like I'm not about to go to the gym, but we are. It is currently 1.43 p.m. I just got done streaming, so I thought I would take you guys through a workout with me, get ready with me, day in the life. I don't know what it is yet, but we're gonna go hit the gym. Let's get ready and eat some food, actually. I'm starving. Have you guys ever had kombucha? It's like fermented juice veggie, sparkling water kind of tasting. It doesn't taste the best, but my tummy thanks me every time I have it. Cause I don't know about y'all, but I have a really sensitive stomach and kind of bad digestion. So I feel like I kind of need a regular probiotic. This one is mango lime. I normally, my favorite one is the coconut mint mojito or the lime mint mojito. I'll plug it somewhere. That's my favorite. Not too bad though. Let's get ready. Hi you guys, editing Taylor here. So yes, my camera did decide to start randomly recording in slow motion and I couldn't fix the video. So here I am washing my face and putting on a tinted SPF moisturizer after. Uh, I didn't take off my makeup because it would smudge pretty bad with my makeup remover. Wow. Hello? Okay, so I'm mildly concerned that it didn't properly record like the last, I don't know how many minutes of footage. So hopefully it's fine. It just looked like it was playing in slow-mo. We'll make it work. First vlog. So we're gonna make a quick little pre-workout meal. Sorry if it's super echoey in here. Uh, we need more furniture. This is what we're working with so far. You will see. It's kind of one of my like go-tos. Um, uh, it's hard to explain, but I'll show you. Oops, shit. My cat freaked out and made me drop my egg. So all it is really is two eggs with some cheese melted on top. I use provolone and I let it melt for a little bit while I toast the bagel. I use an everything bagel, Bagel Thin uh, by Thomas Bagels. And here the eggs are done. And I cut up some avocado and skillet uh, fried, seared some uh, ham slices. And then I decided I didn't like the order I put those in, so I fixed that. And that's the salsa I use. I don't really recommend it. It's pretty mid. Ooh, that actually looks pretty good. Avocado was a little underripe, so I kind of had to heat it up a tiny bit, but you know. Oh, beautiful. And here is my next, usually pre-workout snack, but I'm a little hungry. Didn't have a lot for breakfast this morning, so I'm gonna have both. We have made it to the car and it is now 3 p.m. I think I accidentally put it on some like smooth skin setting. It looks weird, hold on. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> It happened again. So the first thing I do whenever I get to the gym is I usually start off with a 5 to 15 minute warm up on the treadmill. It usually just depends on my mood. Usually a light to brisk walk. It's obviously sped up, but I was probably walking at a 3.2. I lately have been really good about including stretching. I do need to watch more videos for inspiration and just learn up on different types of stretches. But today we're doing shoulders and triceps, so here I am trying to loosen up those shoulders so we don't tweak anything. Flappy bird. And then I always usually start off with three sets of 10 to 12 on the lateral raise. Sorry for the wonky angles. It was a really busy day today, so there was not a lot of places I could go to record.
And then after the lateral raise, I go into the dumbbell shoulder press. Sometimes I'll superset the lateral raise with these. Uh, today I did not. Oh, why did I say that? <laughs> I don't normally do these standing. I do them seated, but it was really busy in the dumbbell area. I usually do about three to four sets of eight to 10 on these. Today I did three sets of 10. And then we go into skull crushers. Sorry, you can literally not even see my arms here. Three sets of 12 for these. And I superset the skull crushers with some upright rows. I usually do three to four sets of eight to 10. And today I did three sets of 10. Here's a little mid-workout snack. Got my little peach gummies and two scoops of whey into the shaker. And I sipped on this while I did some steady cardio. Just got done in the gym. Uh, it was a lot busier than I was expecting, but I guess it is 5 p.m. now, so I should have known better. But that's okay. For the future, I will probably get back on my 5 a.m. gym grind. That is usually a lot better in terms of equipment being used. Um, and I will be using my camera next time. I'll just suck it up and get over my fears because the quality is not as good as this would have been. But that's okay. Uh, first gym vlog and we did have a lot of technical difficulties and it's kind of scuffed, but it's on brand. Also, drink your freaking water. Please and thank you. I actually got inspired by Lean Beef Patty. Um, I know a lot of people do this, but I just recently saw her do it in a video of hers um, where she had a mid-workout snack, or she said she usually does like something like candy or something, I think, carby, but she had a protein bar. I happen to have this little baggie of peach candy that I got from the store, and it's really good. These little Japanese peach gummies. I'm a big fan. And the two scoops of pr uh, protein. It's actually super stocks because I don't usually get enough protein in the day and I've actually been trying to be really intentional about that. Uh, I'm trying to have at a minimum 120 to 130 grams of protein and that's still like on the low end. So I've been hitting at least that, but protein powder definitely helps. To each their own. I am not a certified trainer yet. That is in the works actually, which super excited about that. So take everything that I'm doing with a grain of salt. This is just what I do. Fitness is not a one size fits all. If you did the exact same thing as me, you probably won't look like me. Everybody's different, but these are the things I enjoy. I enjoy lifting. I enjoy a high protein, high carb diet. Everybody's different and you just got to find what works for you. I've been really excited to create this channel and I'm excited for what is in store for the future. If you are still here at the end of this video, thank you so much for watching. Hopefully the next one's better, but thank you for watching anyway. And if you enjoyed this, let me know in the comments or leave any suggestions for future videos, vlogs, whatever you guys want to see next. And I hope to see you in the next one. Thank you for watching.